Good morning! Do you have your portraits on display from yesterday? Yeah. Did you paint them? You know, if you didn't paint them, maybe you could do that as an activity another day. You could put it as a work on your shelf. That would be a wonderful idea. You can adapt these works however you would like to. Well, you know what day it is today. Science experiment day. But first we have to welcome in the day before we get to it. Ready? The sun is coming up. The sun is coming up. We thank the earth for spinning round and being here for us. The sun is coming up, the sun is coming up. We thank the earth for spinning round and being here for us. The sun is coming up, the sun is coming up. We thank the earth for spinning round and being here for us. When I sit at circle, my bottom is on the floor. My legs are crisscross applesauce. My eyes are looking, my ears are listening, my mouth is closed and my hands are in my lap. Tommy Thumb is up and Tommy Thumb is down. Tommy Thumb is dancing all around the town. Dance him on your shoulders, dance him on your head. Dance him on your knees and tuck him into bed. Good morning to you, good morning to you. We're all in our spaces with bright shiny faces and I say to you, good morning to you. Good morning, Miss Alexa. Good morning. Good morning, everyone. I'm glad you're here today. Hooray! Buenos dias, buenos dias. Como estas? Como estas? Muy bien, gracias. Muy bien, gracias. Y usted? Y usted? Buenos dias. Como estas? Muy bien, gracias. Y usted? Well, my friends, what day is it today? What day is Science Day? <gasps> yes, you know it too well. Whoa, whoa, Wednesday is Science Day, of course, which means yesterday was, yes, yesterday was Art Day, which is on a Tuesday. Yesterday was Tuesday, which means tomorrow will be Thursday, that's right. Tomorrow will be gardening day. Days of the week. 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 There's Sunday and there's Monday. There's Tuesday and there's Wednesday. There's Thursday and there's Friday. And then there's Saturday. Days of the week. Days of the week. Days of the week, days of the week, days of the week. Los dias de la semana son siete, son siete. Los dias de la semana son siete, son siete. Lunes, martes, miércoles, jueves, viernes. Sábado, domingo son siete, son siete. Lunes, martes, miércoles. Viernes, sábado, domingo, sunny, 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 is it sunny in the sky? S-U-N-N-Y is sunny, is it sunny in the sky? Cloudy, 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 is it cloudy in the sky? C-L-O-U-D-Y, cloudy, is it cloudy in the sky? Rainy, 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 is it rainy in the sky? R-A-I-N-Y is rainy, is it rainy in the sky? Windy, 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 is it windy in the sky? W-I-N-D-Y, windy, is it windy in the sky? Snowy, 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 is 
today? Oh, well here it is nice and sunny. So I'm going to sing about the sun, but you sing using the word that best suits your weather and we'll meet at the end. Ready? I know a day just like today and sunny was the weather. S-U-N-N-Y, S-U-N-N-Y, S-U-N-N-Y and sunny was the weather. My friends, today is science experiment day and I have a favourite. It's not just a favourite of mine, it's a favourite of many people's and you may have done this one before, but that's okay because we're going to do it again and we're also going to find out the reason why this happens. So, you know we're studying the continent of Europe, right? Right. Well, in some parts of Europe, where Miss Alex is from, in England, it rains quite a lot. R -r rain. So I thought we could make some rain in a jar. But then I was thinking, well, that's so much fun, but why does it rain? Why does it rain? Where does the rain come from in the sky? Well, actually, it's all part of something called the water cycle. Now, the water cycle means that the water's not up there in the sky already. If it rains at your house today, that water was probably in the ocean or the sea or a river a couple of days ago, maybe on Monday, but now it's falling down from the sky. So how did that happen? Rain is a bigger part of weather called precipitation. Precipitation means any form of weather that falls to the earth. Snow, rain, drizzle, hail, all of these things. But how is it formed? The sun heats up the water and changes it into water vapour. This is the process of condensation that rises up into the atmosphere, into the sky. And what is it does is it gathers in and starts forming into the clouds, all of this condensation. Now, if you imagine it's a really hot day, it's been very wet, or the water from the ocean's coming up, and those clouds are getting really full and full and full of condensation, of tiny little droplets of water. When they get too full, they start getting heavier and heavier and heavier. And that's when the rain comes down. So the cloud is getting so heavy that it starts letting go of these droplets of water and the rain comes down to earth, falls to the ground again, falls in the oceans, the rivers, the lakes, the seas, and then the whole process starts again. Let's go and make our rain cloud to see the rain that falls down when it starts getting too heavy for our cloud. Come on. So for this very famous experiment of making it rain in a jar, I have a mason jar. You can use a glass or any kind of jar that you need. I have some shaving foam. I have some pre-made food coloring. Now the reason I pre-made it is because mine is not, is not the liquid food coloring. I had uh, the, the thicker food coloring. So I put it in a dropper here and added a bit of water and shook it up so this can form as my rain. You can also use paint to do this as well. And I have some water. So let's get started. today with a little rhyme called rain rain go away of course and then we will finish with some pitter patter rain breathing ready one two three 
It's raining, it's pouring, the old man is snoring. <sighs> he bumped his head on the back of the bed and he wouldn't get up in the morning. It's a silly one, huh? Let's do our rain pitter patter breathing. So we're going to breathe in and pitter patter out. Ready? Breathe in. Shoulders up and down your right pocket. Thank you so much for joining me, my friends. I hope you have fun making your rain today and I will see you for gardening tomorrow. Goodbye.